So here's yet another screen that is used and older that we need to respect to figure out if we can use it or what we have to do next. So you see a lot of staining of emulsion, certainly a lot around the periphery. We don't want to see as much, but we do, we, we will see that. And you see a lot of what we call hazing. Hazing is just a stain from the emulsion itself. Now it's important when you're inspecting a screen to understand the difference between a stain and a blocking. So if something is physically blocking the screen, that's a problem. If the fabric is stained, but the ink will move through, that is a visual distraction, but not a, an impediment to the actual printing. So we can tolerate a certain amount of staining. Now eventually staining will get bad enough that it becomes physical blockage. So we want to minimize staining as much as possible, plus it's visually distracting if you're trying to keep track of your image. But, uh, but still we can tolerate a certain amount. So the question is, is this an amount of staining that we can tolerate or not? It's borderline. Now try to get close. And let's see if we can see the quantity of, of the pink staining in the screen. You know, for the video, what if I try using the overhead lamps? Is that better? Mm, kind of. Kind of? Yeah. Maybe going directly up to the window? Uh, maybe. We can try it. Let's try it. Can you see the staining much? Okay, you hold. Yeah, that helps. So you can see that there's a fair amount of staining in that, right? And while I'm inspecting this, I don't know if you'll be able to see this with the video. Yeah. There you can just see it. That is a physical hole in the screen fabric. So once I've found that, that really pushes us, pushes us over into a new level. There is only two things that can happen with a hole like that. If I continue to print, that hole is going to grow very fast. So I might get one more layer printed or two more, layer print, print, uh, two more layers printed, but that's it. That hole is very quickly going to become so large that this screen is dead and it just needs to be restretched. Right now, the hole is small enough that we could patch it. But a patch will always be a permanent dead spot. So it'll be a square, about an inch, maybe a little bit more than an inch, that permanently kills that spot in the screen, which means I could use out here and over here and over here. Now, because of the placement, that will effectively mean that from here up is no longer usable. So this whole, Mm, 25, maybe up to 30% of the screen will just become useless. That still leaves this down here, but that's a little dubious. Um, I think with this screen, given the hole in the fabric and the quantity of staining, which would require haze remover, and all that process is gonna grow that hole as well, that I'm gonna say this screen should just be restretched. Okay? So that's about trying to gauge uh, how, how bad or how ready your screen is.